This video will cover the topic, using a calculator to evaluate exponential expressions involving base e. An exponential expression is a mathematical expression consisting of a constant raised to a power. Sometimes it's difficult to evaluate exponential expressions by hand, so we'll focus on how to do this with the help of a calculator. What does the base of e mean? e is a constant we use in different areas of mathematics and is approximately equal to 2.71828. It will appear in the problems we complete for this topic, so let's take a look at a couple examples. 225 times e raised to the power of 0 0.2 and e raised to the power of negative 0 0.45. We want to evaluate each expression and round our answers to the nearest thousandth. How do I find and use the Alex calculator? The Alex calculator can be accessed by clicking on the calculator button on the right side of your screen. Once we've opened the calculator, we need to input our first expression in order to evaluate it. In our first problem, we have 225 times e raised to the power of 0 0.2. So after we type in 225, we need to click the e raised to the power of x button and we'll be able to input our exponent, 0 0.2. We can now click on the equal sign to get our answer. We are asked to round to the nearest thousand, so we'll want to go out three decimal places. Our answer will be 274.816. We can then clear the calculator using the red C button in order to move on to the second problem. In the next problem, we have e raised to the power of negative 0.45, so we can click on the e raised to the power of x button and put in our exponent of negative 0.45 and click the equal sign to get our answer. Once again, we'll be rounding to the nearest thousand, so we'll go out three decimal places and our answer will be 0.638. Okay, so to evaluate exponential expressions involving base e using a calculator, we use the e raised to the power of x button on the Alex calculator to input the expression given to us, and we round our answer to the decimal place indicated. Exactly. Great job. 